Good morning, everybody. Buenos dias a todos y a todas. Welcome to Oyster Adams Bilingual School. I'm Julian Pineda. I'm the principal of the school. Um, it's wonderful to have you here today to celebrate our new playground and participate in the Kindness Walk. This annual walk raises money to feed families in need throughout D.C. In, and it's such an important cause. Happy Halloween. It is great to see all these incredible costumes today. For over 40 years, Oyster Adams has been a model of dual language education in D.C. and across the country. We are founded on the belief that children are born with curiosity and ability to learn multiple languages. In 2020, we were voted a National Blue Ribbon School, a prestigious a prestigious recognition by the U.S. Department of Education. This is a testament to our incredible staff, students, and families. One of the things that I'm most proud of at Oyster Adams is, the, is a diversely rich community. This new playground will serve as a space for our students to create lasting bonds with one another and to celebrate their cultural heritage. I can't wait to see the memories and friendships that will be made in this beautiful outdoor space. While there are many people to recognize for making this new playground a reality, I want to give a special thanks to Mayor Bowser and to Chancellor Ferdy. Our city is fortunate. Our city is fortunate to have such a strong leaders and advocates for public education. And before I came in as the principal to Oyster Adams. My predecessor, Principal Maida Cruz, did so much to ensure this new playground would be one day come to fruition. And here are we today. With that, I'd like to bring in our amazing Tigers, third graders who are going to say a few words and are going to welcome our special guest today. Thank you. They are Jay Garcia, Ana Tesma, Delany Coladeiros, and Christian. Matamoros. Hi, my name is Jake. I feel happy, loved, and challenged at Oyster Adams. Me encanta ser un tigre. Delaney Colley. I'm proud to be a tiger because I am bilingual. Soy feliz de ser bilingual. Vamos tigres. <laughs> My name is Ana Tesema. I'm proud to be bilingual and have so many amazing friends. Bienvenida. <laughs> Hi, my name is Christian. Something that makes me proud at Oyster Adams is that my teachers make me feel I am capable of anything. Thank you for our new playground. Vamos Tigres! Hola, buenos dias. Me llamo Muriel Bowser, Acadesa de Washington, D.C. And I wish I was bilingual. So what you are getting here at Oyster uh, is a very, very important skill for the rest of your lives. And so I couldn't be more proud to be here with our Chancellor of D.C. Public Schools, to be here with our Council Member for Ward 3, to be here with our ANC Commissioners, to be here with all of your teachers. Let's give your teachers a big round of applause. And to be here with your parents and friends of this beautiful school. Let's acknowledge our student presenters this morning. Didn't they do a great job? I also want to wish you a very happy Halloween. Uh, and I understand that you just got back from your kindness walk. Uh, and boys and girls, if you can spread that message to your friends, and if we adults can spread that message among each other, what a beautiful world we would live in. 
I want to acknowledge the work that you're doing for your food drive as well. I am so impressed with everything going on here at Oyster Adams with your food drive, your kindness walk, your annual book fair, and of course your advocacy for this beautiful, beautiful facility. We know boys and girls who have uh, all of the support that they need being loved and challenged. They also need the facilities that help them thrive. Uh, and so I am just very uh, pleased that we are able to deliver uh, that to you here at your beautiful school. We know uh, that the Oyster Adams staff in particular has been very instrumental in leading and implementing the dual language program here. And we know that isn't always easy. The demand continues to grow for bilingual education uh, because there's so many benefits to learning a second language, not just the language itself, um, but the, the study skills and all of the benefits that you get academically from being able to speak two languages. Uh, and we know the Oyster Adams community has um, been on a journey. Um, parents, ANC commissioners, council members, including what our own Jason Fink, who is our ANC commissioner for Oyster Adams. Thank you, Jason, for your leadership uh, to deliver this renovated uh, turf field. So I'm going to uh, continue to go all around the city and tell them about the great job you're doing here at Oyster Adams. And I know that we are all pleased and welcoming our new principal to step into leadership with this great institution and for you boys and girls. We continue to be so, so very proud of you. And I want to introduce a woman who has been instrumental in helping to lead education throughout War 3 and has been a staunch advocate for your school, Council Member Mary Che. Hola. <laughs> um, thank you very much, Mayor, and uh, thanks to the guests, but hello especially to all of our wonderful students. Um, as you know, or as you may know, I know the parents do know this, uh, for 16 years now, um, I started it when I first came into office, I conduct readiness tours of all of uh, my schools in Ward 3. And the idea is to identify any issues that exist that we can get straightened out before the start of school. Sometimes the issues carry over because it may not be a straightforward fix. And I have to tell you, for 16 years, I've been trying to get this field fixed. <laughs> now, <laughs> yes, and here we are, I'm just so excited. Um, now, it would happen that when I would come, there would be issues maybe about the fence or about this or that or so something was loose, and we could make those little fixes, but the field needed to be fixed. Now, you can't always get everything right away, and I have been attempting to get the money to do this and have this done since that time, and Mayor Bowser happily uh, put the money in the budget, in the last budget, so that we could get this done. So thank you, Mayor, thank you. very much. Um, this school is very special, and you all are very special. And you could hear that in your representatives from, from your classes. You, you love this school. You feel loved here. You feel you can do anything here. Your teachers are inspirational. And again, actually, we, you can never do this too much. Let's have a round of applause again for all of your teachers. And for all of the soccer champions that playing on this field are going to come out and play for DC United. Thank you very much. I think I'm supposed to do something. Stacy. Okay. Hi, everyone. Hello, Oyster Adams. I'd like to invite my uh, good friend, Francisco, to come and help do a little bit of Spanish translation. So thank you, Francisco. Thank you. Thank you. Um, 
We gather today to officially open the new Oyster Adams Playground. Hola Oyster Adams, hoy nos reunimos para inaugurar oficialmente el nuevo parque infantil de Oyster Adams. There are many people we want to thank today. We want to thank Mayor Bowser, Councilmember Che, Chancellor Faraby, and Councilmember Jason Fink. We also want to thank Principal Pineda, Assistant Principal Bearcall, and former Principal Myra Cruz. Thank you to the Oyster Adams Community Council, that's our Parent Teacher Association, the LSAT, and all the parents that helped us advocate for this project. And we want to say a special thank you to the wonderful teachers, staff, and students of Oyster Adams who work hard every day. We would not have been able to renovate Oyster's Playground without your support. Thank you for everything you have done for the Oyster Adams community. Hay muchas personas a las que queremos agradecer hoy. Queremos agradecer a la alcaldesa Bowser, al concejal Che, al canciller Ferbi y al concejal Jason Fink. También queremos agradecer al director Pineda, a la subdirectora Berrocal y a la exdirectora Mayra Cruz. Gracias al Consejo Comunitario de Oyster Adams, nuestra asociación de padres y maestros, el LSAT y a todos los padres que nos ayudaron a abogar por este proyecto. Y queremos agradecer especialmente a los maravillosos maestros, personal y estudiantes de Oyster Adams que trabajan arduamente todos los días. No hubiéramos podido renovar el patio de recreo de Oyster sin su apoyo. Gracias por todo lo que han hecho por la comunidad de Oyster Adams. For 50 years, Oyster Adams Bilingual School has served as a model for dual language education in the district. In 2020, we won a National Blue Ribbon Award. We are a bilingual community and our students develop their academic knowledge in two languages. The cultural diversity within Oyster Adams creates long-lasting friendships among students and families from different backgrounds. Our diversity is our strength. Durante 50 años, la escuela bilingüe Oyster Adams ha servido como modelo para aprendizaje en dos idiomas de educación en el distrito. En el 2020, ganamos un premio de National Blue Ribbon. Somos una comunidad bilingüe y nuestros estudiantes desarrollan sus conocimientos académicos en dos idiomas. La diversidad cultural dentro de Oyster Adams crea amistades duraderas entre estudiantes y familias de diferentes orígenes. Nuestra diversidad es nuestra fuerza. Mayor Bowser, we look forward to continuing to work with you as we renovate the Adams campus where our fourth through eighth graders learn. We want to work meaningfully with your teams for the next three years on this important project. Alcaldesa Bowser, esperamos seguir trabajando con usted mientras renovamos el campus de Adams, donde aprenden nuestros alumnos de cuarto a octavo grado. Queremos trabajar de manera significativa con sus equipos durante los próximos tres años en este importante proyecto. Thanks to everyone's support, our students will now play on a beautiful new playground that is fun and safe. The whole community is very excited. Thank you for your support. Nuestros estudiantes ahora jugarán en un nuevo y hermoso patio de recreo que es divertido y seguro. Toda la comunidad está muy emocionada. Gracias por su apoyo. ¡Vamos, Tigres! Thank you so much uh, to our parent leadership who's always working hand in hand with us to better our school communities. And our final speaker will be our Chancellor of DC Public Schools, Louis Farabee. Good morning, thank you, Mayor Bowser. I have to say I was very impressed welcoming our students back from the Kindness Walk. Let's give our student representatives, all our students a round of applause today. Uh, your your sense of celebrating the day of Halloween with a kindness walk and also your food drive is extremely impressive and we know it wouldn't have been possible without the adults supporting you. So also another round of applause for our educators, our school leaders, our parents and guardians that support the families here at Oyster Adams. And I couldn't have said it better in the previous presentation that your diversity truly is your strength. Uh, and it's something that we recognize and it's part of our efforts to ensure that you stay on a path of educational excellence and to continue to support students academically. We know that having play space is an important part of that. 
And so we're excited that there are two play spaces I want to highlight. So we have one up above us for our younger students. And then behind us, we have another play space for our older students. Uh, as uh, Mayor Bowser mentioned uh, and Councilmember Che mentioned, uh, these are important elements of ensuring that our city has best in class facilities. And the turf field was mentioned earlier today, and I hear there's a very strong soccer program at Oyster Adams. So we're excited that you continue uh, to have access uh, to what you need to be successful. This wouldn't be possible without the collaboration and partnership of the Department of General Services. Uh, so please join me in recognizing Director Anderson, who's also with us today. We're proud to continue to partner uh, with an agency that keeps us on track to ensure that we're able to deliver on projects like these. Again, thank you again to all of our partners uh, who made today possible, continue to advocate for our children, and to our young people, uh, continue to enjoy the day, and we look forward to visiting your book fair. Thank you.